What's going on, everybody on the Twitch on YouTube? TG, so good, everybody else. Okay, so I had the CPU playing so I can get some footage together. So we're in the third quarter. We're going to jump into instant replay. I finally figured this thing out. So there's options to use the photo mode. You have to click down on your left analog stick or L3. And then on your directional pad, the D pad. The little thing that looks like a cross up, down, sideways. If you click the left and right buttons, once you're in photo mode, it will go through all of the photos that have been captured during the game. And as I said, I got all the way to the third quarter with the CPU playing. So now I can go through this photo mode and it's basically what's called a press book where the press has taken all kind of portraits during the game and some of these portraits look absolutely amazing so this video here will serve as your tutorial for how to use the mode yesterday I, I just kept clicking that l3 um left analog clicking that in i kept clicking that over and over and it wasn't giving me the results i wanted so you just click come into instant replay click that l3 or left analog stick down uh, click it in one time and then use your d-pad left and right buttons and you will be able to uh, navigate through these photos. So as you can see, this is a photo. You can actually move around in some of them as long as you don't make, uh, as long as you don't go forward or backwards in time, it will keep that same photo realistic look and lighting and all of that, like I'm doing right here with Jamal Murray. Also, when you're clicking left and right on your directional pad, the D-pad, um, sometimes it'll give you like, you might get through all the photos and then go back and forth again. It'll give you a different angle of a specific photo, or it might just give you an all new photo, which you didn't see the first time you were scrolling through. It's amazing. It's amazing. So if you are a guy that plays like my NBA, even my career, or, uh, you know, you create custom custom jerseys and all of that and you want to see you know diff your team's progress like you can save all of these photos and it it just becomes it's nice it's nice to have you don't have to manually take these you just um it's nice so anyway if you go into stats you can press y or triangle um on a player and then it'll show you their highlights you can also come here in the game summary or i think it's called you see the score summary or game summary? I think it's score summary. But you can come here and you can actually press A to go into a replay. If you press Y, it will it changes the order of the events. Like the last thing that happened might be at the top. Press Y. Then it'll put you at the first thing that happened during the game. But anyway, um, all right, so I'm gonna cut this video short my son is playing roblox in the background i don't know if that music is non-copyright so i'm gonna go ahead and get out of here uh again those that left analog stick or l3 click that to get in photo mode and then use that d-pad to go left and right all right guys i'm out you have to be an instant replay to do this all right guys i'm out